Hey, what's good, guys? It's your boy Cali. I'm here with Patrick Super Duper Roy, and you're watching Path of Glory. You already know, man. This is the glory right here. You feel me? Get your hands up. No, ah. man. <laughs> <laughs> What made you decide to um, <laughs> to get into boxing? Well, I always watch um, boxing with my dad when I was a kid, you know. My dad would always watch Tyson fights and other fighters and stuff, and I will be right next to him and watching the fight so much to the point that I would try to do the same moves like that in school and get in trouble, and then I would end up getting beatings, you know, when I was a kid. So. Ever since then, I just have the passion for it. And it's really because of Mike Tyson, you know, Ray Leonard and Roy Jones and James Tony and Mayweather before people thought of Mayweather, so. so those are the guys that um, inspired you? Yeah, a lot. All right, so, um, so I'm saying, what goes through your mind when you're training for, for an opponent? Well, what goes through my mind Man, it's tunnel vision. I don't see nobody around me. I just, I just stay focused. I just think about opening them pearly gates and you know, just just do this for my family. You know, that's why I'm thinking about my mother. You know, and you know, I think about my father a lot also. So I think about my family a lot. What kind of open doors I can open so I don't have to struggle anymore. Definitely, definitely. And um, I seen you training the other day. I mean, you could just talk about the, I guess, the mental state you got to be. Because you, you was doing a lot of, <laughs> you was going in. Yeah, yeah. It, it was, it was, it was, it's a, it's a mind thing, you know. Like, the training I was doing is, it's, it's all, in, all in your mind. Anybody could do it. It's all in your mind, you know. And when you train hard like that, you just, you have to be self-motivated. Basically, you gotta have um, a good team around you too, then. A yeah, good team. A, a good team, cause you know, boxing is good and bad at the same time. You know, and um, amateur, yeah, you know, it's good, and you doing things, you doing tournaments and stuff. But turning pro, I'm not pro yet, but you know, a lot of um, great fighters that talk to me tells me that you know, you know, the pros is not a good sport. You know, it's a good sport, but it's not good business-wise. So, you know, there's snakes and there's people that will rob you and there's people that will not give you a fight at all. And, you know, so that's why I try to build the right team that I can that it will not happen to me. Definitely. So you plan on becoming pro? Yeah. How long do you think? Probably a year or two. A year or two? Okay. Definitely. You know, and, um, you know what I'm saying? It, it, yeah, people say, you know, do it for yourself, you know, but yeah, I am doing it for myself. I already got what I needed, you know. Really, I'm doing it for my, my family, my mother. She works hard, you know, and it's hard for me sometimes when I'm running around these streets and hustle and do all the things that I don't want to do but just to get by. So, you know, I'm just doing it. I'm just grinding hard, much hard as I can to I don't have to work hard anymore. I know you definitely received like a lot of backlash from people, I guess, because of your age and everything. So, um, what do you have to say? I'm pretty sure there was, um, you know, like champions that made it afterwards. So, I'm pretty sure you, you wouldn't be the first, but I know you you receiving a lot of criticism. Yeah. You know. Yeah. Do. I get that a lot. I just tend to block it out, and this it motivates me more. Definitely. You know, it, it motivates me more when people saying that, oh man, you, you're a little older, man, you know, like, how you gonna do this and you're older now, you know what I'm saying? I'm still young, yeah, you know, but you, you're older now, like, how you gonna do this, you know? And it's like, I know what I'm gonna do, you know? It's just hard work, dedication. What kept me up and my, my way of doing things and knowing that I could succeed in this is my skill, man. Like, I've been boxing since I was a little kid and I'm a grown man now, so, I'm taking my talent, I'm taking my skills, and take it to another level, you know. And I'm just trying to shock the world, and I am gonna shock the world. And I believe you are. Like I said, I seen you training, and I, like, for the most part, the people that I see backlash, I don't think they could go wrap around with you anyway. Exactly. <laughs> you know, <laughs> because everybody got different beliefs, everybody got different opinions. You know what I'm saying? It's like this, man. 
it's never too late to go to school, right? Right. So it's never too late to catch your dreams. You just have to you gotta be motivated. motivated and open them gates, man. I'm trying to knock on that door. I'm trying to bust that door down open and say, yo, I'm here. Definitely. You know, because look at Bernard Hopkins. He's 50 years old and he just won a world title. Oh, he's, he, yeah, he just won a world title. He's 50 years old. You know, and he won, it, he won it at 50 years old? Yeah, oh, it's, right. yeah not too long, a couple of months ago. You oh, know, right. and um, he started at what? 24, 25, he turned pro. You know what I'm saying? So anything could happen. You know, it's just how bad you want it, man. Definitely. Definitely. So um, let's talk about the training process. Like, like what do you do? Like, your workout? What's, what's your routine? Well, do 15 laps of running, you know, in the track field. And after that, um, I do my pull-ups, my push-ups, dips right after I'm done running. Or or sometimes just run in the morning and then go home and shower up, eat a little sign and go straight to the gym and do my other workout regimens, you know. So it's like working out twice a day in one day. Twice a day? Yeah. <laughs> that sounds like a lot. It is. It's just your mind, you know. Just gotta love what you do. Cause once you're in shape, everything's easy. Alright, cool. But after you become pro, what's next? Family. Family. You know, own a couple of businesses, and you know, start marketing, and you know, other things. You know, that's why I do this. You know, so I can have other options so I have to do this anymore. Boxing is a violent sport. Like, if you was to have a son, because I know now you don't have a child, but if you was to have a son, do you think this is a sport you you see them doing? I think so. If they want to do other things, they could do other things. I'm going to support them. If they want to box, I'll support them with that too. But, you know, hey, I'm just here to support my kids, man. If I, if I, if I, if I, if I, if I.